Hit that subscribe button and bell icon so you never miss an update from Neela Bakore Tutorials. In the previous part, we talked about the general characteristic features of the class Reptilia. Now we'll take some important examples of reptiles. We'll take uh, two examples which are very similar to each other. One is Testudo, that is Tortoise and the Turtle, that is Chilon. And we'll compare them on some characteristic features. So if we talk about tortoise, they show amphibious nature. That means they can be found on land as well as in water, whereas turtles are marine. The next important thing is in case of tortoises, because they are terrestrial also, they lead their life on the land also, the limbs are pentadectylous, that means there are five digits and with claws. Whereas in case of turtles, the limbs are modified into flippers. Flippers help them swim. In both the cases, that is in tortoises as well as turtles, the body has a shell. The difference is, in case of tortoises, the shell is very, very prominent and oval in shape. Whereas, in case of turtles, it is slightly uh, depressed and we say it is heart shaped. It helps the animal to defend itself. Whenever it is attacked, they withdraw their body inside that shell. In case of tortoise, they can withdraw their body completely inside the shell. Whereas, turtles can withdraw their head partially. So, we can write can withdraw complete body in the shell, including the complete head. Whereas, in case of turtles, they can withdraw head part specially partially. So, because they live in different areas, their habitat is different, they show certain adaptations like one has flippers and the other one has pentadectyle limbs with claws. The common thing is that they have shell and the shell has upper and lower part. So this is the common thing. The upper part is known as carapace and the lower part is known as plastron. These are the two parts of the shell. So this is the difference. General characteristic features are same. That means they have three chambered heart and respiration is through lungs and all. One special thing which is seen in case of turtles is, we are writing it here special thing is, they show cloacal respiration. In the cloaca region also there is exchange of gases which takes place in case of turtles. The other example is of the wall lizard. It is a very common uh, uh, animal which we see around us and its scientific name is Hemidectylus. The wall lizards, <coughs> they have adhesive pads beneath their digits. On ventral side, of digits. 
lizards can make sound but they don't have vocal cords except one lizard. Now how do they make sound? They make sound by hitting their tongue on the roof of the buccal cavity. Roof of buccal cavity. The only lizard which has vocal cords is known as gecko or sometimes it is also called yeko. It has vocal cords. So this is the only lizard which has vocal cords. One more important and interesting thing which is seen in case, case of these wall lizards is they show autotomy. This is a mechanism of self-defense. <clears throat> so whenever they are attacked or whenever there is a threat to them, what they do is they chop off their own tail. They cut off their own tail in self-defense. So if any other animal attacks a lizard, it cuts off its own tail. So you would find that piece of tail waggling and the entire attract, uh, attention is drawn towards that cut off tail and during that time the lizard escapes. That cut tail will, be, will degenerate but the lizard will regrow that part. That means the tail is going to regrow in case of these lizards. So this is a defense mechanism which we see in case of these lizards. One more example is of chameleon. Chameleons, they are known for the coloration of their body. They are able to change the body colors according to the surrounding. So, according to the surrounding. This is the unique feature which we see in case of chameleon. So, these are some uh, examples. There are more examples which we will be discussing that is snakes are also there. We will also talk about crocodiles and alligators.